Greetings, hello, and welcome everybody. Death's Crowbar here with you today. And today, I'm just glad to be able to give you guys a video. Um, so, just to give you guys a little idea of what's been going on and why I haven't had a video out, why I haven't streamed any lately, why my writing's been slow, and everything else. Uh, so, I started college last week. So yeah, I think it was last week, maybe week before, whatever. I started college, um, and that just kind of is taking up some of my time right now. Uh, it's kind of boring, uh, mostly know almost all the concepts, and so, you know, re-going over concepts can just be boring. Um, but I'm making good grades right now, so... That's fine. So, uh, basically, I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about what happened this summer and uh, some of the stuff I went through on a trip that uh, I, I was gone for about two weeks, nearly two weeks or so, uh, due to a trip I took. And uh, that led to no videos that week, no streaming. In fact, I could barely even contact people much during those two weeks because I was with family. So what happened was, uh, near the end of August, my we were going up to see my uncle, my granny, my granddaddy, my other uncle, and my aunt, and their kids who are my cousins up in Washington State and uh, we got there and had fun did a lot of stuff and went to uh, Silverwood which is in Idaho and uh, you know just had a lot of fun while out there and did a lot of stuff played a lot of board games uh, and Basically, we had some trouble coming back, so due to the fact that college kids were going places and people were coming back from call, from uh, bringing their kids to college and stuff in that area, um, we had issues with flights, got rerouted to Vegas, had to stay in Vegas for 24 hours. Before we could come home, I do have footage and pictures, but have just not had the time to get everything going. Um, I was going to put together some stuff, but I had some computer issues, had to reset all, reset my hard drive, just, you know, wipe the hard drive, had a virus that just, it was causing, a, well, I guess it's a worm, technically, you know, it was replicating enough that it was causing my computer to shut down at a certain point of usage, which... I thought really would not work well if I'm making videos or streaming, so I pretty much had to get rid of everything, clean everything up, and so now I've got more hard drive space again. Uh, some of the stuff that should have just been temporary files got uh, deleted and all of that. Stuff I should have gotten rid of a long time ago. Um, so, yeah. So now i am got everything back up. I have had it up for a few days, but uh, had to get programs downloaded, and with college and everything, stuff's tough, having to write papers and do homework and stuff, even though uh, I feel I could easily just have skipped most of these classes. So yeah, um, been having a lot of fun since I got back. Uh, my whole thing with college is, okay, I'm going to do school, I'm going to do college, and I know there's this whole idea of you can't do but so many things while going to college without, like, absolutely killing yourself or whatever, uh, but I'm trying to keep everything pretty much similar to how I've had it throughout the past bit. So, uh, Mondays, I, they're my longest day, and I go from 8 a.m. to 3.50. I'm going to UACCH for Texarkana 
right now and uh, then I have shorter days throughout the week but I've still got to do homework and stuff which you know makes them a little bit longer uh, th this isn't very good with writing because I want to do more writing uh, for Christian Dash Gaming again but it's just kind of hard to come home write an essay have to edit half of it out because they only want so many words and then you know then try and after editing it checking everything going and writing a couple articles <coughs> whether it be news or reviews but I'm trying to get back into that I'm trying to make more videos trying to get more let's play stuff done I need to get a few things made up for different things and I plan on some special videos soon I've got another loot crate video coming up this month that should it will likely be the last one as I'm not getting enough support to keep it going and I don't make money so you know I'm kind of pretty much bankrupt right now and uh, the only money that I have going for me is my grants that only cover my school so yeah um but everything's been going well been hanging out with people gonna go to the fair this weekend and uh things should be fun uh you can expect more videos from me soon hopefully if i can get everything done i i plan on making a video tonight depending on some terms of service stuff uh haven't actually looked at it but i'm in the beta for something and I need to check the terms of service to see if I can stream it but if I can I'm gonna stream it either like make it let's play or stream it or something for you guys to see I'm hoping to start putting more videos out again uh, about just health and general stuff with me and how things are going and keep up the vlogs because vlogs are going to be the easiest right now um, but I do plan on doing some let's plays every single week and I'll be doing some of those with m some of my friends uh, one of those being Kitty Talia X23 and another Dark Star Squid I uh, can't remember the numbers I think like 120 or something but yeah so we're we'll hang out and play some different multiplayer stuff, some Gmod, some different things like that. I also want to keep you guys up to date on my health and things that are going on with my health. Um, so, you know, I'll post videos occasionally about that, about how stuff's been affecting me, how things are going with certain things, and all of that. Uh, please excuse the mess you see over there on the top bunk. I've really as a college student have absolutely no time to clean my room anymore where used to I could just you know get it done when I needed to get it done now it's like if I want to do anything I've got no time to do anything else so uh, I'm still reading and reading is something I will not stop doing for whatever all right i think reading's important it's a good thing to do you the a good passionate thing of reading if you're passionate for reading keep going at it if you're not passionate at reading read enough where you become passionate for it because reading helps increase vocabulary writing skills reading skills speaking skills even and it's just a great tool to be a great reader. So right now, uh, I'm reading two books, Side Jobs, which is the 14th book in the Harry, in the Dresden Files, the books about Harry Dresden, a wizard in modern day Chicago, trying to be a private investigator while also battling the forces of evil. Great series, guys. I actually recommend it to all of you though there are some more mature things in it so you know you may be wary if you're a younger reader I'm also reading this 
Essential Truths of the Christian Faith by R.C. Sproul. R.C. Sproul is a great theologian, one of the best Christian theologians of our day. And I know some of you will be like, eh, it's a Christian book, blah de blah I'm an atheist, blah de blah Here's the thing. I read the Iliad, I read the Odyssey, I read stuff like that. I I read Plato, Aristotle, alright, in, uh, the Christians, we have to learn, as Christians, we have to learn not only what we believe as Christians, but what the world believes. We must learn the language of the Chaldeans, as it said, and, uh, you know, that's something for us to know. So, you know, if as Christians we can learn of the world, we can learn of what other people believe, what they feel, and things like that. Um, you know, I feel as, you know, atheist or whatever you believe, know, at least know your enemy, you know? So maybe pick this up, figure out what Christians believe or should be believing one way or another. You know, it. maybe you pick something up from it. Maybe you don't. Uh, maybe it's just a good reference guide for you. But if you are a Christian, I highly recommend you read it. I know you may find certain things controversial, and that a lot of people these days don't want to argue doctrine and theology, but as Sproul puts it, as a Christian... The only thing of eternal consequence is God, the love of God, the study of God, and the knowledge of God. As the Westminster Catechism puts it, what is the chief end of man? The chief end of man is to glorify God and to enjoy Him forever. And to properly enjoy God, we need to study God. And that is what theology is. And doctrine is simply teaching. And if you're going to say doctrine and theology are bad things, Christ taught doctrine and theology. Paul taught doctrine and theology. Peter taught doctrine and theology. If the apostles taught it, if Christ taught it, it's surely not a bad thing. It's something we should learn. I mean, I believe Ephesians is where it says, you know, we are not to be children tossed to and fro by every wind of doctrine. So to that effect, I say, read it, no matter what faith you are, no matter what kind of Christian you are, read it, see what you think about it, you know, tell me what you think about it if you read it, you know, maybe it's hogwash to you, maybe it's not, but, you know, read it, tell me your thoughts, you know, one way or another, It's a good thing. You can either read it to know what other people believe, to, as I said, know your enemy, or read it to know more things about the Christian faith. Alright, so, yeah. Alright, so what else to say? What else to say? What else to say? Uh, plan to be picking some different things to do soon. Um, went to Texarkana Comic Con when it was here uh, just a weekend or two ago, and that was cool. I got to meet uh, James M. Ward, and uh, he's, you know, one of the co-creators of D&D. He did Pools of Radiance. If any of you have ever heard of that, He's the guy. He's awesome. It was nice getting to meet him, getting to talk with him and chat with him. And he was a cool guy overall. Um, I also met Mika Nicole. Uh, she was a pretty cool cosplayer. She was wearing her Phoenix outfit. And, uh, you know, if you haven't seen her, check her out. Uh, I'll leave links to her Twitter and Facebook because I cannot, for the life of me right now, remember what her Twitter is, her Twitter handle, because I don't say it very much. Usually if I 
say a Twitter handle a lot. I'll remember it, but that one I don't. All right. And, uh, yeah. I do plan still on going to PAX South. I need to get myself a media pass or something of the sort. And I think I can find a place to stay. I know I've got a way to get there. I'm probably going to have to have someone take me to and fro, but I think I got someone who can help me with that. So that should be good. Uh, so, you know, we'll see. And uh, if I do go, you guys can meet me. <coughs> Alright, so I think that's it, guys, for now. Expect more videos coming your way in the upcoming weeks. More vlogs, more information about me, how things are going with me and, uh, you know, different stuff. Uh, to anyone who might be a game developer out there, maybe, possibly watching this, uh, I'm gonna try and start making a reel so that I can, uh, do voice acting. A voice acting reel with just some voices on it, some different things I, I can do, and also expect some odd comedy videos that I'm going to see how they turn out and you know if you guys like them cool if you don't whatever it's I'm here to entertain you guys and you know to yeah entertain make people happy for some reason I'm hearing screaming um but yeah entertain people make people happy so And, uh, yeah. Alright, guys. So, uh, anyway, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, share, and subscribe. I know this has been kind of lengthy and maybe a little dull, and I'm sorry about that. Um, just kind of getting back into the, you know, loop of things and everything, and, you know, want to kind of cover all the bases right now. Uh, so yeah, don't forget to like, comment, favorite, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to, you know, visit the links I've got below. Uh, if you want to donate to me, I've got a Amazon wish list down below. You can donate stuff to me. That would be cool. But, you know, if you don't, that's fine. Uh, I'd really enjoy it if you subscribe, because I really need to get my subscribers up. My goal for this year is 100, and I am think I'm a little over half that. So I'm hoping you guys can help me pull that up to 100, or maybe even higher than that before this year is over. Okay, so as always, to all you nerds out there, to all you gamers, and to all you geeks, keep doing what you do, because you guys... You're awesome. Alright. This is Death's Crowbar, signing out.